This midday, we're monitoring the Smithfield Foods plant in Cudahy following President Trump's executive order requiring meat processing plants to continue operations. The Cudahy plant has been closed for the past couple of weeks. Adriana Mendez is at the Smithfield facility with the latest. Adriana? The parking lot here has about the same number of vehicles as it did yesterday, so it's unclear as to if the Patrick Cudahy plant is back open and fully operational. The plant closed about two weeks ago following a coronavirus outbreak among workers. A spokesman for Smithfield, the company that owns the Patrick Cudahy plant, says the facility is being cleaned, but did not say if operations were resuming today. There are a lot of questions regarding safety and the number of cases that have come from this processing plant, but the Cudahy Health Department and the mayor are refusing to answer our questions. The union that represents the workers provided free COVID-19 testing for the Patrick Cudahy employees, and they say they are continuing to work with local officials for improved working conditions here. Safety conditions at meat processing plants have been under scrutiny across the state. OSHA has been called in to investigate this plant and other plants in Wisconsin. Vosis de la Frontera issued a statement today in response to President Trump's executive order calling it irresponsible due to many meat plants being virus hotspots. Reporting in Cudahy, Adriana Mendez, TMJ4 News.